Heat records were set in Southern California, seven of them right here in San Diego County. And the warmer and drier weather brings a fire danger with it. Chief Meteorologist Carleen Chavis will have your weekend forecast in just a moment. But first, News 8's Teresa Sardina has more on the heat wave from Mount Soledad. Look at this incredible view from Mount Soledad. Well, many are bundling up in the Midwest here across the county. There's dry and warm temps. No need for a jacket. We've been dealing with uh, blizzards. I know, Teresa, when you guys talk about blizzards, you're going to Dairy Queen and having a, a great treat. Blizzards in the Midwest, sunshine in San Diego. We're talking weather with Chief Meteorologist Chris Schaefer of WCCO TV from the rooftop of the CBS station in downtown Minneapolis near Minnesota in the snow on Zoom while News 8 reports from Mount Soledad in La Jolla. I'm so jealous. <laughs> Schaefer says west of the Minneapolis St. Paul area, there's been a blizzard warning. The wind is averaging over 35 miles per hour. It's snowing. You can't see more than a quarter of a mile. It's it's awful and obviously dangerous. These winter storm warnings, you see them coming and you talk about them for days and everybody's obsessed, of course, about the snow totals. How much snow are we going to get? Um, but it's fun. I mean, we were in danger of having a brown Christmas this year, which you guys have every year. Um, but the kids don't like those here. So fortunately, we got about eight inches of snow. A different view here throughout the county in mid-January. Santa Ana winds, dry and warm temperatures raise fire weather concerns. Our local mountains and East County reach the 90s. Along the coast, many are soaking up the sun in the 80s. It feels so nice. San Diegans say it does not feel like winter. It's sunny. Right here, it's beautiful. The water's a little cold, but the weather's great. Right now in San Diego, Friday afternoon, it is 83 degrees. What is it like for you in Minnesota? A whopping 34. <laughs> and I gotta tell you, that's mild for this time of year. Let's see how long these dry and warm temperatures will stick around. Let's check in with Chief Meteorologist Carlene Chavis. Thanks, Teresa. And Chris, you're more than welcome to come and visit us anytime and soak in this sunshine. We are definitely talking about some toasty temperatures for today, and they're going to stick around for tomorrow, but it will be a little bit cooler. We had some 90 stretching towards the coast. 92 degrees was the high today for Oceanside, 90 degrees for Carlsbad, 88 degrees for downtown, as well as some 90s that we had for the valleys, 94 degrees in Vista today. Temperatures for tomorrow, as I mentioned, they're going to come down just a little bit, but they're still going to be above seasonal by about 10 to 15 degrees. So still talking about warmer than usual temperatures tomorrow as the 80s look to stick around most of the valleys as well as 70s returning to the coast, which is a nice break from 90s that we had earlier today, unless you really like these toasty temperatures. So it's summertime just in January <laughs> and taking a look at the setup. We have an area of high pressure that triggered the Santa Ana winds that also helped to bring temperatures to the toasty side. That's going to move towards the east. Yet another high moves in for tomorrow and we still have an elevated fire risk to talk about as well.